First tonight, a Georgia congressman is now backing the Atlanta Police Union and calling for a special prosecutor in the Rayshard Brooks case. 11 Live's Shanu Her explains why the district attorney may not be replaced. On Sunday, some state leaders stood behind the Atlanta Police Union publicly showing their support for officers. Some officers emotional as they spoke about morale and fallout with some communities following the death of Rayshard Brooks and two of their colleagues charged. We do the job to protect. We expect to be protected by our leaders and they've all failed us. All of them. So I appreciate you all. I'll be in here. <laughs> Fulton County DA Paul Howard charged former officer Garrett Rolfe with murder and Devin Brosnan with aggravated assault. Congressman Doug Collins slammed Howard's decision to charge them before the GBI completed its investigation, calling the move political. Howard is running for a seventh term and Collins is making a run for a U.S. Senate seat. You cannot prosecute cases until the investigation is over. You don't do it for politics. Your job is to find justice for everyone, not race, not class, not anything else. Collins is asking Attorney General Chris Carr to remove Howard from the case and appoint a special prosecutor similar to the Ahmaud Arbery case out of Brunswick. But Carr cited a state law saying he can't do that unless the DA requires accuses himself or a court removes him. This call comes after several officers have called out sick following the charges. Mayor Keisha Lance Bottoms on CNN Sunday morning had a message for officers. This is not about division from our public safety personnel. We value our officers in Atlanta, but this continues to be about where we are in this country and making sure that we don't have people who are part of our force who are not respectful of our communities. Shinu, her reporting for us.